Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise, love, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rakaha, Kudash, double honors to your apostles and LGMS, who will teach well, being great examples to us younger brothers, and peace and blessings, salutations to the hopeful look out there, pushing the word and truth, and in sincerity across the four winds in the name of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, pushing to get up out of him. Shalom to the hopeful look, the believers, the listeners that have came back. To the obedience of the scripture through faith in Yahweh by Shema Shah. And what I wanted to get into today, you know, was how, you know, we are at the end of all things, man. Esau Edom, all right, is on um, full steam ahead, you know, when it comes to pushing forth his new world order agenda. You know, Esau is not being idle, you know, he's not slowing down, he's full steam ahead, you know, and getting the world vaccinated and getting the world chipped. And setting himself up, all right, as the guys upon earth, man, you know, under the vibration of Satan, man, you know, under the spiritual demon Satan, man, you know, Esau is full of throttle, you know, and I want to play this on um, a quick video, get a couple of precepts, you know, Lord will, you know, brothers, you know, and a few sisters that watch are edified. Smoking memories of Cold War era rivalries. The world is now engaged in what can only be described as a vaccine race. Major world powers are scrambling to develop and deploy a safe and efficient vaccine against coronavirus. And it has become a matter of pride for the likes of China, Russia and the United States. So let's get you an update on how close each country is to developing a ready for use vaccine against this lethal disease. In China, there is hope that the vaccines will be deployable by November. There are four vaccine candidates being developed in China as of now, out of which three have already been offered to essential workers. China's CDC announced that phase three of clinical trials were proceeding smoothly and that the vaccine should be ready for use by November. What did they say the vaccine, you know, will be offered to essential workers, man? You know, because you think you're in a good case, you know, because your job is uh, considered essential. You know, but these are going to be the first jobs where they want to initiate these vaccination, man. And most of these jobs uh, that are uh, essential, you know, are, are jobs that Jake work, man. You know, your garbage truck, you know, your um, your, uh, your different grocery stores and your different um, gas station, man. This is mostly what Jake and the nigga woman work, man. You see? So at the end of the day, Esau Edom, you know, like I always say, Israel is always in the target, you know, at the top of his agenda when it comes to wickedness. Now, uh, he's going to destroy, you know, a lot of people in the earth, but at the top of their agenda is always Jake, man. You see, the tribes, man. You see? China's state-run pharma giant Sinopharm and Sinovac are developing three of these vaccines. The fourth one is being developed by CanSino. CanSino's vaccine has already been approved for use by the Chinese military. Meanwhile, the AstraZeneca trial has hit a roadblock. The trial is on hold in the United States over some side effects observed in Britain among the volunteers. The U.S. Food and Drugs Administration will now probe into these side effects and after which a call will be made on resuming the trial. In Britain, however, AstraZeneca has resolved these issues and has resumed the clinical trial. Let's now get to the vaccine updates from Russia. The Sputnik V vaccine is already in civil circulation. 250 Muscovites were inoculated in the past five days or so, and all of them remain in good health, according to the Russian state media. Small batches of the vaccine are being shipped across the country to test the supply chain. However, concerns remain over the safety and efficacy of this vaccine, as it was approved in pretty quick time. Now, countries are moving to secure enough vaccines for their citizens. South Korea, for instance, is planning to inoculate at least 60% of its entire population, or 30 million people. While authorities would like to vaccinate the whole population, the uncertainty around the vaccine's efficiency and safety is holding South Korea back for now. So there you have it, man. You know, Esau Edom is orchestrating, all right, a global you know, vaccination, man. Now, he gives you this story, you know, as if, um, you know, that there have some places that are still in the trial phase and some people are already initiating and, you know, getting things started and, you know, like, like, like it's a, uh, actual race, you know, for this, uh, for the vax, man. You know, but we already know these things are already pre-planned and prepared, 
all right, he's just playing his role, you know, within his narrative, man. You know, as if he's trying to really help, you know, um, the masses, man. But we we know, all right, that Esau Edom, you know, is uh set to do a lot of wickedness in the earth, man. He's set to destroy a lot of people, man. You know, and Bill Gates himself said out of his own mouth, you can look it up, all right, that these um vaccines, all right, will help depopulate the earth, man, because one of their arguments is that the planet Earth, you know, is too populated, man. You know? So let's get some um some precepts, you know, and um close it out, man. You just want to touch on that real quick to show you that this devil is full throttle, you know, with his plan. You know? And if you trust in this devil in any any type of way, man, you're finna be devoured, man. You see this is first Peter chapter four. Um uh, Let's say First Peter four and seven. It says, "But the end of all things is at hand. Be ye therefore sober, and watch until prayer." Yeah, we at the end of this thing, man. All right, we're at the end of the rulership of the heathen, man. Esau even was the last, all right, heathen nation, you know, prophesied, all right, to rule in the earth, man. You know, and we're at the end of his rulership, man. We're at the end of our captivity, all right. We're um, finna go into world war, which will be the end of wars. We're at the end. Of everything, man. You know, in the beginning of everything for the Israel, beginning with the elect. You see, but there has to be a lot of things ended, all right, before our righteous rulership is set up, you know, in the earth, man. You know, and it says, be ye there sober, be level headed, man. All right, we need to be in the spirit of having clarity, man. You don't need to be, you know, uh, uh, you know, be foggy, you know, drunk all the time, you know, out of it all the time, man. You know, being distracted with the cares of this life, man. You know, this is the time to really be locked in, all right, to um, what Yahweh Bashima Shai, you know, is doing, you know, in the earth, man. You know? So, as we um, uh, pay attention, you know, to these current events, to the news, you know, to the patterns of this devil, you know, what the devil is saying, you know, reading between the lines, man, it's, 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 it's important. All right, that we have clarity when we do such, man. And says, and watch unto prayer. Yeah, man. You know, because we need to pray for the mindset to endure, man. We need to pray that we stay faithful, all right, to the testimony of your house shot, man, to the end, man. You know, we need to be, pr we need to pray, you know, that we're built for the time that's coming, man. You know, because it, anything outside the hedge of your house by Shema Shai, you know, coming into this time that we're coming into, we're going to be through, man. You know, we need to pray for protection, man. We need to be pray, you know, to be protected from the, the devices of this damn devil, man. You know, so that's all he's doing is plotting and conspiring, man. And he's not stopping, man. He saw Elam is full-fledged into, all right, what he has going on, man. And we need to be full-fledged on the right-hand side. All right, so this is Psalms 2 and 1. It says, why, why do the heathen rage and the people imagine a vain thing, man? And it's going to the word rage, which we always go into. And the Hebrew is ragash. All right. It's, it says to be in a tumult or commotion, to conspire, to plot. And that's all we see Esau doing is conspiring and plotting for his new world order agenda, man. You know, for what's to come. You see? What, what, what he uh, uh, expires to come, man. What he conspires to come, you know, setting up his new world order agenda in earth, man. You see? So as we see this man plotting and conspiring, you know, what we should be doing, man. You know, on our watch, praying and informing, man. Being obedient, man. You know? Because the Lord is going to upset, you know, this man's um, intentions, man. All right? He's not going to be able to perform, all right? That new world order, man. You know, so we can go to Job five. All right, but it's here, man. You know, it's here. His he he's here, man. Hey, he's putting these vaccines in people as we speak, man. You know, he's got them ready to go. You know, like I say, he's pushing this narrative like you know he's struggling trying to get it ready, man. But we know all of these things are pre-planned, man. You know, and it's and it's here is is here, man. You know, this Job um, five and um twelve said he disappointed. The devices of the crafty, so that the, their hands cannot perform their enterprise. He taketh the wise in their own craftiness, and the counsel of the fraud is carried headlong, man. Yeah, man. So we know he's going to be overthrown, 
you know, in his attempt, you know, in world domination, all right, and wickedness, man. You know, he's going to be overthrown. He's not going to be able to accomplish, all right, his wicked conspiracy, man. You know, so <clears throat> just wanted to bring that out real quick. Lord will, you know, you brothers and you few sisters, you know, that were edified, you know, until the next time, Shalom.